Back now with the story unfolding right now in Fort Worth, Texas. A woman shot to death by police after they were called to check on her house. Shooting, sparking protests tonight. Here's Kathy Park. Just released body cam footage shows the moments leading up to a deadly shooting. A Fort Worth police officer is seen walking around the outside of a home, shining a flashlight on the walls and windows for closer inspection. He stops, points his flashlight at a window, and draws his gun. Put your hands up! Show me your hands! Up. Fort Worth police issued a statement saying the officer perceived a threat, drew his weapon, and fired one shot, striking 28-year-old Tatiana Jefferson. Police say they entered to provide first aid and also found a firearm in the home. Jefferson died at the scene. Fifteen minutes later, I heard a loud noise, and I saw five or ten police officers surrounding the house. And I don't know what happened on the inside of the house. All I know is my neighbor is dead. James Smith said he called a non-emergency number out of concern for his neighbor. All the lights in her home were on and doors open. Smith believes she might still be alive if he never dialed for help. If you don't feel safe with the police department, then who do you feel safe with? Do you just ignore crime or ignore uh, something that's not right? The unidentified officer who has been with the department since April 2018 is now on administrative leave. Tonight, Jefferson's sister devastated. I just don't understand, like... These are men that's trained. What kind of training is that? Kathy, do we know what the police say the officer perceived as a threat? Yeah, that's all part of the larger investigation. It's still unclear why the officer reacted the way he did. And police tonight aren't saying exactly where that firearm was located in the home. So still a lot of questions tonight. Kathy Park, thank you very much.